It is extraordinary to think that four years ago, over 20% of the top 100 uh, companies in the UK had never had a woman on their executive committee or their board in their history. The landscape is very different today. I think one of the key things we have to do is really build that pipeline of female talent. And if we don't provide the right development to our staff, they could easily get stuck thinking that what they do now is all they're capable of. Whereas with really good development interventions, their minds will open up, they will take risks, they will move to other jobs, develop more confidence. It's better for the organisation, it's better for the individual. Retention's going to be a problem and you're going to not move and develop the people that you have so they stagnate or they move on. So it's kind of a bottom line issue for me. It's not nice and fuzzy and making the world a better place. It's about making your business a better place. We know how absolutely essential it is to equip women to develop the skills they need to be impactful in the organisation. What's absolutely essential is to support the managers in leading these women and understanding that they need to know what the headwinds are that these women face in order to remove the key obstacles. Corn Ferry is uniquely positioned to address this issue with clients. First of all, we know their business context and their talent strategies, deeply involved with finding the right talent and optimizing the talent they have. So this isn't just about equality, it's about uh, results. I am so excited about Corn Ferry's approach to developing female leaders because we come from a place of shared responsibility and that's exciting. There's a responsibility on the part of the female leader to continue to build her skills and capabilities and they're offering the level of mentorship and support and advocacy to ensure that she gets an opportunity to rise in the organization. So I think it's great. I mean, I love it. And I think it was a very strong message because it's not us to rethink why we should be here. It's for, I think, a lot of men in companies to understand why women as a plus and bring something additional to, to the company. Mm -hmm.